Hi guys, Rich Bassin from RJBassin.com. Coming to you today to do, hopefully, a brief, a brief demo video on this Sony Dream Machine. Very sleek. Uh, it's the ICF C273, I believe. That's what it looks like here. Yeah, 273. Let me get my, I think my magnifying glass because the print is getting so small lately. Yeah. Yep, that's it. C273. Um. If this is the first time coming to my YouTube channel, or in this particular case, the eBay listing, my name is Rich Pacini with RJPacini.com, and I go under the eBay user ID, for those who don't know, it's uh, Shop RJ Pacini for great deals, and what I like to do is talk about the item I'm putting up on eBay, and to give you, the potential buyers, an idea of what I'm selling, I like to talk about the condition of the item, and this way, and the reason why I do this here, folks, is in case I miss something out in the, in the written description, uh, at least we have a video description that, that might, you know, pick up where I left off, so to speak. So, without further ado, let's just talk a little about the see the, the overall condition of this, this Dream Machine clock radio is nice. It's pretty clean, considering um, it doesn't really have any, uh, it has like little light markings on it, but nothing really bad that could affect the, uh, you know, the, the playing of the system itself. Um, it's, a dual, it's a dual alarm radio. And um, it's pretty clean overall, as you can see here. I don't know if you can see that, folks. It's pretty clean. Now, the only thing I did notice about this, folks, is over here, I think right over here near the snooze button here, it looks like now maybe somebody might have had a ring on their finger, but like, it looks like a little, little pit mark over here. See here? Along here. But overall, as you can see in the video, it's pretty clean. It's a clean radio. All the way around, pretty much. That's the bottom of it there. I don't know if that's the model number on it, whatever. Oh yeah, there it is right there, Sony. Yep. And uh, that's what we got going on there. I don't know what that's like. I guess the labels are a little messed up over there, but that's about the only part where there might be a little markings on the bottom here. But otherwise, it's overall condition is clean. I also like to do live, um, the live, the reason I like to do live videos is just to show you from, right from start to finish about how the thing works and stuff. So. I'm going to put the webcam down here on this black towel I got here. Sorry, folks. And I'm going to do it live. I'm going to have to cut my radio on my background music here. And uh, take this off. You don't have to unravel the whole thing. I have an extension cord right next to my desk here. I'm going to plug it in. I like to do everything live, folks, so you see, see it working. And I'm just going to cut this down. I'm going to mute it so we could just take it from there and listen to it it's gonna be hard to listen to it at the same time but you could see it works and it's got a bright switch you now for brightness I want to make sure something here I want to make sure I don't know unless I'm not doing it right um, it doesn't look like it dims it down too much it looks unless if it does it's news to me how that's done but um, that's the brightness on it I don't know but I know I got a lot of glare in here too folks so you gotta bear with it here but as you can see, it does. It is uh, on, okay. And the uh, when you hit the other buttons on, they work as well. See. So you do have. Uh, it does work. Okay. All your preset buttons are right on top here. Okay. You got your clock setting. You got the DST, uh, daylight savings time for summer. It is a nice. It is a nice, very sleek. I, you know something. I like Sony products, Ben. I'll be honest with you. I didn't know they make all these different types of radios. I mean, I never really ventured into them, until you start picking them up at thrift stores. But um, they really are nice radios. Uh, I like this one myself. I was thinking of keeping it for myself, but I had one. I have a GE. I had for a long time. It's one of those big square ones. You know, it's you can see it's an old fashioned type. Well, you can't see, it, but it's an old fashioned type one. But this one here is nice. I like the face on it here. It's got a nice face. It's like a I don't know, like a, a light lavender or violet color, shiny, you know. And it's really nice. It really is. It's a nice radio. I think you guys would like it. I think you'd really appreciate it, especially if you put it on your nightstand. Uh, you got a small table. This here would be, fine, you know, nice, probably nice size for it. The overall size of it, uh, if I take a ruler out, let's just see, just for curiosity. Um, let's see, here, guys, just to give you an idea. I, I, I don't put the measurements in our radios, but... So you figure out, oh, I don't want to scratch it, so I'm just going to hold it up like that. So basically, whoops, I'm covering, oh, that doesn't help covering your numbers. <laughs> so without, 
I don't want to scratch it, but you can see it's roughly around, um, well, my webcam is terrible. It doesn't really zoom in all the way here. There it is. Roughly around, it's roughly about five inches, maybe, a little less, see? And the width of it, you know, the width is, uh, again, I don't want to put it on there because I don't want to scratch it. This has a metal blade on it there, so I don't want to scratch it, but uh, you, you get the idea of it, see? It's roughly, I don't mind the rule of my kids but playing at them in a little. I got roughly around six inches, maybe five and a half inches or six, whatever. Yeah. So it's small, and the profile is not that that big either, as far as profile wise. So, anyway, um, that's irrelevant, basically. <laughs> I don't know why. I just I, I just thought I'd share that with you guys, in case you're wondering the size of this thing. Um, it is small, as you can see. You know, here's my mouse next to it, so yeah. <laughs> Or a mouse pad, or whatever, but it, it's kind of it's a small it's a small little radio. But um, let's turn it on and see what it can do here. Um, again, I don't own the radio, so uh, you have to bear with me with the channels and all that stuff. They're tuning. Let's see here. Whoopsie. Now you get a lot of static around this area because I'm next to a hospital that has a zillion antennas on, so you got to bear with me on this here. So, okay, so this is um, this is the AM band. AM comes around pretty decent around here. A good station, a good strong station around here is 880 for us. I'm in the New York area here, so as you can see, it comes in nice and clear. When you can count on staples, access your files from email, the cloud, or USB, and then print, copy, fax, or scan them, and get back to business fast. Visit your nearby staples. Okay. But you can see it's uh, it's got a nice sound to it. Uh, let's see. The other band. Bear with me here. I'm trying to get the band here. Let's see. Okay, that's the FM band. Give me a check, a second to uh, try to get a channel on there. I'm not going to play any music, folks, because you know I don't want too much copyright material there. Uh, eBay, not eBay, uh, YouTube picks right up on that. They got an algorithm that searches for that stuff, so I want to try to get a talk station if it's possible. All right, I'm not going to keep this on too long. Okay, that's an FM band. Okay. Okay. All right. So that's it. All right. I'm gonna shut it off. I'm gonna shut it off because, folks, I don't want. I don't like to leave it on too long like that, especially when it comes to music. Uh, as you can see, this does work. This radio does work really fine. Um, if you are interested in it, you got any questions about it, uh, please note there is no original user manual or original package that comes with it. I do offer a 30-day money-back guarantee, so. Um, uh, you will get it safe and sound, nice and well packaged. Uh, the only thing I ask to all my buyers or potential buyers that will receive these items from me, the way I send it to you, please send it back to me in the same condition. Uh, if you, if I, I send it to you well packaged, I would like to, you know, I would like to have it back well packaged as well, because I, you know, most likely it's going to be resold again, you know. So uh, that's why it's very important that I get this back in, you know, good condition. But anyway, if you have any questions, folks. Please message me on the eBay uh, messaging system. I'll be more than happy to answer, answer any of your questions that you may have. If this is the first time coming to my YouTube channel, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. If you like what I do with these videos, please give them a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. If not, that's okay. I do these videos, like I said, you know, I forgot, I didn't say it in the intro, but in the beginning of this video, I do sneak peek videos, uh, intro videos, demo videos. So this one here is uh, basically a demo video to show you that it does work. And when you receive it, you should have no problems with it. Unless something happens, gets run over by a truck, you should get to you in one piece, not in pieces, as I always say. So thanks again, folks, for uh, stopping by and checking out the video. And in this case, uh, for YouTube, well, I should say not on YouTube so much, but um, for the eBay listing, because this is for you guys, the potential eBay buyers. And I hope you like the items I have. While you're on the website or while you're on my, uh, in my listings there, view the other items I have. You might be interested in some other stuff I have. I offer a lot of best offers. Uh, please don't hesitate to make a best offer on uh, any of the merchandise you see there. Um, for the most part, I will accept them if they're reasonable. If you're going to send me, you know, if you're going to make an offer that's something totally ridiculous, like if this was selling for $10 and you say I'll give you 5 or or 4 or 3 for it, um, I won't respond to that there. I'll just automatically decline it. Uh, but I do respond to the best offers. And for the most part, I've been accepting quite a bit of them. Okay, so um, please don't hesitate and uh, share, pass the word around. 
Uh, if you got anybody that's out there that, that never shopped with me before, I'm an honest seller. I'm top rated plus, and uh, I stand by my word. You know, and everything I do. Uh, if there's something wrong with an item, I will let you know. That's why I do the videos. Um, these videos I do to uh, enlighten you, the potential buyer, to let you know what you're getting ahead of time. So it won't be no uh, hit or miss or you know surprises when you get when it arrives in the mail. But uh, but thank you very much for stopping by, guys. I really appreciate you checking out the video, and this particular case uh, checking out my uh, eBay listing. You have a great day. I'll talk to you soon.